What's up guys, Dylan with Sonas Vita, and this is about a four-year-old generic Pop-Tart. That's right guys, I am back, Dylan with Sonas Vita. Sonas Vita is Latin for sound life. I am a sound guy and this is my life. And this is my old Walmart brand Pop-Tart. Now, back in the day on my previous jobs, I used to carry around a lunchbox with my lunch in it. And in the front pouch, I would have a couple snacks, including generic brand Pop-Tarts. Well, as time got on, that lunchbox got pretty much destroyed. So what I ended up doing was getting a backpack that had a cooler slot in it, and that replaced my lunchbox because I used the backpack to haul around my gear anyway. So I put that cooler lunchbox up in the cabinet for years and forgot about it. Well, last night I was cleaning out some stuff and came across the lunchbox and looked inside and sure enough, here was this cherry generic brand Pop-Tart. And uh, I'm gonna eat it for your entertainment. Now, I don't recommend doing this with any type of food past its expiration date. These have a shelf life of a few months based off a current box that I have, but I figured, why not? It's probably not gonna kill me. If anything, it might just make me sick, but I have the rest of today and tomorrow off to recover, so yay. Now, I know this video isn't like much of the other stuff I do on this channel, but again, sound guy, my life, this was part of my life, so uh, let's crack on and let's eat it. There's still air in here, which is a good sign. It still smells the same. I think this will be a very uneventful video because it still looks the same too. That looks 100% normal. All right, let's eat it. It, it looks fine. So if you watch YouTube channels like Steve1989 where he eats expired MREs and old food like that, he takes little nibbles. I just went in for a big bite and um, it's a little firmer than normally is. It tastes a little, it, it a little stale, like it's a little mushy in a way. Um, It actually, it seems like it lost its taste. Like, I don't, I don't taste anything. Except a slight aftertaste of like cherry flavored medicine. All right. Um, the texture changes a little bit and it loses its taste. Uh, that was, that was pretty uneventful. I do apologize, but there you go. So that's what happens if you leave a generic Walmart brand Pop-Tart in your lunchbox for about four to five years and then find it in your cabinet. So there you have it, guys. If you wanna see more videos like this and perhaps more entertaining videos in the future, make sure you subscribe to this channel. Don't forget to like and leave a comment and let me know if you want me to eat something old that I find next. I usually don't leave things that are old sitting around, uh, except myself. And if you wanna see more action-packed stuff with cars and things like that, Head on over to my primary channel, youtube.com slash thatdeltabravo. Link in the description for that as well. That is my bigger channel. That's where all the fun stuff is. This is where all the vlog and audio type stuff is because it wasn't doing well over there. So I figured you guys might enjoy it more. So it is safe to eat those generic old Walmart brand Pop-Tarts. However, I wouldn't recommend it because if you get sick, I don't want you suing me. Once again, I'm Dylan and this is Sonas Vita. Sonas Vita is Latin for sound life. I'm a sound guy and uh, this is my life. Thanks for watching and I will see you on the next video.